What's going on guys, Mr. Lad here. Before we get into the video, just want to say, here at the Mr. Lad channel, we provide great content for auto detailers and enthusiasts where we talk about auto detailing needs, reviews, and how-tos. So I would love for you to go ahead and press that subscribe button as well as put a like to the video. And stay tuned for all the Mr. Lad community uh, videos because we're going to be doing a lot of stuff in the future and a giveaway is coming up soon. So would love for you to stick around for that. But that being said, going into it, Non-acid wheel cleaners are a product, they, that, that is a line of products that I happen to really like. reason why I like them is because they are aggressive, uh, aggressive enough to tackle most situations, yet at the same time they are not going to be too aggressive or they would damage wheels in which you are concerned about compromising the integrity of the wheel. So there's a company that's been around for some time but doesn't really have much face in the detailing community called Car Candy. Uh, my impression of them is that they they probably accommodate more of the car wash market yet they have a lot of products that do work well within the professional high-end luxury detailing community and one of those products would be their chocolate thunder chocolate thunder is a non-acid wheel cleaner that works great in all situations um, and I love it for many many purposes one purpose is what I'm going to be showing you today which is the wheels not so much the tires although we will do it on the tires but at least the wheels of the vehicle another reason why I love non-acid wheel cleaners is they work great with bugs and removing grime because I don't like putting degreaser against the vehicle uh, yet this seems to work very well at uh, removing bugs so Chocolate Thunder, uh, it's a, it's, I, I've used it quite a few times. Car Candy actually sent me this bottle, um, and they, they sent me it, uh, and my experience so far with it is it's good, and I've been using it full strength, although the bottle says you can dilute it uh, for different reasons, and it says, I believe it says dilute up to four to one. Um, yeah, mix four parts, four parts, Chocolate Thunder to one part water, spray directly on cool rims. Okay, so maybe not four to one, maybe one to four, which is a little interesting. But it's a way of diluting the product. You know, just use standard dilution ratios and work from there. I personally don't dilute it. I go full strength, so it doesn't matter for me. Uh, but let's give it a try and let's see how it works. I know how it works, but let's put it to the camera and let's see how it goes. So, I've already rinsed down the rim and the tire. So we'll spray inside the barrels. Now, what I'm going to do is I am going to let it sit for a little bit, and I'm just going to go ahead and try it as a spray-on, rinse-off product. Uh, that's what I love. As a detailer, I love products that save me time. Um, so what I will say about this product is the, this, the fragrance is not the most pleasant of fragrances. Um, so if you are concerned about smells, this is not really a good product. It's not a horrible smell, but it definitely doesn't have like a pina colada or a fruity smell. It's going to have a more abrasive smell. Not only that though, it is a, as you can see, it's a dark chemical. And so whatever you spray will trickle down and get onto the surface or to the floor, tiles, um, cement, asphalt, whatever you're working on. So keep that in mind. So I've been letting it sit for about 20 to 30 seconds by now. And what I'm going to do is try it as a rinse on or spray on rinse off product. And let's go ahead and give it a spray. Uh, the pressure washer doesn't, it's got air in the lines, it's got air in the lines. Okay, so that's a pretty decent, that's a pretty decent and thorough rinse. Now, of course, I'm not expecting perfection, but what I would like to see is, is there any improvement? Now, of course, there is going to be improvement, but how much improvement is there actually going to be? And let's go ahead and let's do a test. From one wipe, I've got nothing. A second, I still have nothing. Let's do the center. I still have nothing. Now, I'm assuming if I wipe down on the, the tire, now I'm assuming there's gonna be something there, but let's go in the barrel. Let's see how much there is. So I'm still picking up nothing. Very barely anything. 
that is awesome. There's very, there's barely any dirt coming off. All the color I see on the towel is just because of moisture. So that is good. That means that this product is doing its job. It is attacking the surface of the wheel. Now the tire, yeah, it didn't work on the tire. So I wouldn't use this as a tire product. Um, I would still use a dedicated tire cleaner, but as a wheel cleaner, a spray on rinse off wheel cleaner, a product like this works very well. And uh, I'm gonna say this for wheels is two thumbs up for tires. I wouldn't, I wouldn't use it for tires. Use a dedicated tire cleaner. Um, but that's just a quick little review. And it gets the job done. It attacks the calipers without damaging anything. It's safe for all painted surfaces as well as unpainted as well. Fortunately, these are painted, so uh, I don't have anything to worry about. But it's very easy to use and very safe. So, guys, once again, let's go ahead and let's, let's, let's bring it back in here. Chocolate Thunder by Car Candy. Um, reach out to them. They have an Instagram page, Car Candy Detailing Products. Uh, tell them that Mr. Lad sent you. If you want to say Bo Million, feel free to, to say that or Mr. Lad. Um, but Ashley from Car Candy, she's great. She, she communicates very well and she loves talking to her clients and her customers. And she will give you whatever information you may want or need. Uh, but you know what? I'm going to try some more Car Candy products and I'm going to do more reviews on them because I happen to really like so far what I'm seeing by them. And uh, yeah, I'm look, looking forward to trying out some more of their products. But guys, thank you so much for tuning in, for listening. Once again, please uh, subscribe to the channel, like the video, share it, go ahead. We're going to be talking about more great content and uh, would love for you to stay tuned. So guys, once again, thank you for everything. Mr. Ladd here, checking out. Have a wonderful day.